All right, we're gonna hook up this TDS recon to the total station right now. On the back side of this total station is what's called the data out port, and I'm gonna hook this up very gently with the cable that I have, and this is screwed into the bottom of my TDS recon. So what we're gonna do now is demonstrate how to set up this Sokia total station to this TDS recon. First of all, we need to go into the Sokia total station and hit escape, go into configuration, which is abbreviated by CNFG, go into communication setup down here and hit enter. And it'll show the baud rate, the data bits, the parity, and all of the information for communication setup. We're gonna go down into the TDS recon and under file, make sure we're in the correct file or job ensure that we're on guideway, hit open. That's the one we created for this specific job. Then we're gonna go into job, into settings, and we're gonna set up our instrument. So under settings, if I go under instrument here, it will give me the opportunity to create a new instrument. Now, this one I'm going to name Sokia. So in capital letters, I'm gonna type in S-O-K-K-I-A and hit enter or just press my button on the screen. I'll select the brand under this drop down. So obviously I'm going to select Sokia. Down here under the model, you should be able to identify what model it is from the specifications. But this one right here is set. The serial port communications one, the serial port on the back side and the one on the bottom of this is correct. The baud rate is 1200 BPS and the parity right here is not set, so I'll put none. So I'll go ahead and hit the check mark and my Sokia total station defaults and I can hit activate and then hit my check mark and my Sokia total station is set up for this data collector.